Hello and welcome to our tutorial on troubleshooting. In this video, you'll learn the ins and outs of the troubleshooting platform, how to understand your analysis, where you can get help if you need it, and more. Okay, so we're gonna start off on this main dashboard page when you open up troubleshooting and any files that you already have existing will be here. But you can also upload files super quickly and easily. But I'm also gonna show you that you can drag and drop a file onto your dashboard and it will upload. And there you have it, it's all processed. So we're gonna to go to view and jump into the summary screen. So again, right away, we can see the 25% network health score and it lets us know that that is critical. I'll also point out the diagnostic check summary to the right of that button, where we can see that there are 20 checks that have passed, one that's a warning, and four that have failed. You can also look at the diagnostic checks panel here. So we have these all ordered based on priority. And a great approach is to address those issues at the top, not only because they're more critical, higher priority, but also because Resolving those issues might resolve some of the issues lower down. And there you have it. That's your breakdown of the troubleshooting platform. If you need any help, our support team is standing by to help. You can just click this yellow chat button here and start a chat with our support team. We've seen all sorts of different network issues over the years. So we are definitely here to help whatever you need. Thank you so much for watching. We hope that that was helpful. If you have any questions, be sure to reach out to us over support, email, or phone, and check out more of our videos here in here and subscribe up here.